that I have for you. My weekly done haul. This one um, is, I, I feel like it's exciting. It's, it's exciting for me. Um, I was actually able to find stuff kind of this week, so I'm actually pretty stoked about that. So, uh, I'm just going to cut it short. If you want to see what I found this week while done hunting, then go ahead and just keep on watching. So the first thing I'm probably going to start with is mugs, just to get them out of the way. I only have two. So the first one that I got is Dog Dad. So found this, um, and I decided to pick it up. Connor doesn't bring that much coffee, but I did want to get it because it kind of completes the set of like the Dog Dad, Dog Mom mm -hmm. mug. He always has to insert himself somehow in these videos. Well, you're going to film while I'm here, so... I don't have a choice. Um, so yeah, I did decide to get that. And I know that I had said that I wasn't going to get anything patriotic, but when I saw that there was like 15 of these, I kind of just broke down and I was like, well, I guess I'll get it for the day that I drink coffee on 4th of July. So I got the USA mug, red lettering, blue interior. Um, again, didn't plan on picking any of these up, but um, I just couldn't turn away the opportunity of actually getting a holiday mug, so I had to get this, so I did pick this up. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to show is the thing that I met up with one of the girls in my Facebook group to buy from her. I was under the impression that it was something completely different, but I'm not really mad about it because I am a huge makeup fan. So the thing that I picked up was... Well, she sold me the wake up and makeup. It's this little tray. Um, I was kind. Of, I, I guess I wasn't really specific when I said uh, like I'm an ISO list. Like the wake up and make wake up makeup, um, like the brush holder. That was what I was looking for. And she had said that she had wake up and makeup, but I didn't see in the message that she said tray. So it's like I kind of stabbed myself in the foot from there. But this is gonna be cute just to display around my makeup area anyway. So again, wasn't too mad about it. I was just like. When I saw it, I'm like such like a person that I'm just like, I'm not going to bring it up. Like, I'll just deal with it or whatever. But when I saw that she handed me this, I was like, this isn't what I wanted. But it's all right. Um, I still think it's really cute. And again, I'm a huge makeup lover. So this will be in my makeup area. So I can't really say I was excited about it, but I'm also not mad about it. So I got that. So the next couple of things, um, I stopped in Home Goods after I met up with her. And I found these. And I had bought two of like the round ones, I think like last week, and I found these and I actually really like them. I'm kind of converting all of my brushes into these brush holders. So I got one that says makeup brushes and the one that says beauty box and they have the big squares. So these ones are going to hold a lot more brushes compared to the other ones. I'm still going to use those, um, but I wanted to have like two of each. So I did pick these up and... Um, I just think they're really cute. Some people don't really care for these, but I actually really, really enjoy this line. Honestly, I saw the um, the tissue holder with just the eyelashes, and I would totally get that. But it doesn't really go with the long letter decor that I have in my bathroom now. So that's the only reason why I haven't picked, picked it up. But I absolutely love this line. I think it's so cute. Um, so I did want to get these. So I got these as well. So yesterday I did go done hunting, and I wasn't really expecting to find anything. Um... But yeah, I found some great stuff. So, the first thing that I found, I had saw that these were recirculating again at TJ Maxx. Whoops! And um, I really didn't think anything of it. Uh, I knew that they were circulating, but I didn't think I was going to find them. But I went to a TJ Maxx that I feel like not a lot of people go to because it's in like a big shopping center right off of the strip. And I feel like a lot of people forget about that because it just recently opened. And because... It's more like a touristy area. A lot of people try to avoid it. So um, when we were going out yesterday, I was like, oh, you know what? Let's stop there because it would have been like 10 minutes after opening. So we went there and we found these guys. We found bloom, flower, and stems. So I was really excited about these. I was happy to see that they were recirculating and I was really happy that I was able to find them at TG Maxx. And these were $7.99 each. So just a heads up about these, but I love these. I think they're so cute. And the way that Molly um, displays hers, like above her sink, um, she's Molly Nicole XO. Yep, that's her name on um, YouTube. I'm sure you guys follow her videos. I just like the way, the way that she um, displayed them. So uh, I'm probably gonna do something very similar. So I wanna take those. The next thing that I found yesterday, I, I did a shop with me and I already started editing that video 
but that's going to go up after this one. And I'm so mad because there are so many more possibles in the video that I saw than what I actually saw in the store because I was like kind of overwhelmed with everything. Um, so kind of mad about that and Connor was like, oh, I, did, I thought that you saw those. And I'm like, no, um, but I got a possible that says soup. But uh, yeah, there was a couple more with things that I don't have and I'm like, son of a. So yeah, I got this. I'm uh, really excited to see that. I do have like just the regular bowls that say soup, but we love the possibles. We use them like three times a week. We love them. They hold, they're, they're so good. The next thing that I found, I picked it up because I wanted to trade it, um, hopefully in the future, who knows, uh, but it's missing a top and it's the baby yum canister. I already have one myself. And it's in there, so I figured if I could get any good trade out of it, I'll just you I'll just swap that out and just use this or use the um the lid to cover this if it's for if it's gonna be for a good trade. But I just decided to get this, and because it was missing a lid, I was like, can I get a discount? Um, just seeing if I could, and they actually gave it to me for seven dollars, so I was pretty psych psyched about that. Um. Yeah, I don't know why they don't mark it down beforehand. So always ask. So always ask, yeah. Connor says to always ask because I would have paid full price, like $9.99 regardless, but if you can save money anywhere you can, buying this damn pottery, but I can take advantage of it. I am going to bleep that out. I, I apologize. The next thing that I found was um, the last stop that we did yesterday. And I was like, well, the second to last stop. And I was pretty surprised to find this. Um, I didn't know that they were recirculating again, so... When I saw three of them, I was like, wow, okay. And I've been looking for this because I want to put, you know, stuff in it. And it is the favorite things little box. And I think it's just so cute. I thought it was for some reason $9.99, but it's $7.99. So, I don't know, it's just really cute. Um, yeah, I was just really excited to find this. So, I got this yesterday. So, the next couple of things. One, I bought from Mercari because I just broke down. I get major FOMO, I should really find that mug somewhere, because I get major FOMO when I see everybody getting items and I just don't either don't have the time to go to openings or I'm just so busy that I probably will never get it and that's just like kind of the mindset that I have when it comes to Ray Dunn most of the time, which is kind of an issue. Um, I found, this, or I bought this. So I bought the Treats, treats Please canister off of Mercari. I didn't think it was too bad of a price. I think I got it for like 30 which is still double the price, but I don't know. I, oh no, it's more than double. This was $12.99 originally. You would think that this was like, this would be $14.99. But yeah, no, I, I had to get this. I absolutely loved it. I love all of the dimples on it. One of my favorite canisters. And I just, I couldn't wait. I couldn't wait. I know that it hit Vegas, and I'm just kind of person that's like, well, if it hit, I'm probably never going to find it. So... I'm just going to buy it because <laughs> I just get so impatient. So the next thing that I bought, I bought from a girl that was just selling a bunch of stuff off of our Facebook page. And if you guys know, I am not decorating for the 4th of July. I'm just going to, after, I think like, begin, probably like the second week of June, I'm probably going to take down like my spring decor and that's when I'm going to decorate for um, summer. And so I'm trying to acquire pieces for the summertime so I'm looking for the sand surf and sea canisters so if you know any let me know I do have an old canister that I think I just want to get a decal of one of the three like C I think because that's probably the one that would fit the best on there so if any of you guys can do um, decals let me know in the comments below because I really really want to just buy one that way um, I can I can repurpose this canister that I have uh, so yes, comment below if you can create a decal for me, and obviously I'll pay for it and everything like that. So let me know. But anyways, yeah, so I am trying to find um, summertime pieces now, and this girl was selling the set, and I was like, heck yes. When I first started done hunting, I saw this initially, but I didn't think anything of it. Not knowing, like, how the done world works, but I was excited that she was selling this. So I got the Beach Bum um, mug set, and she sold it to me for retail, so again, super, super excited for this. Um... Again, just trying to acquire summer pieces at this moment. And the last thing that I got, I got it in a trade, and I traded my teardrop chirp birdhouse.
for this birdhouse and it is the acorn chirp i am in love with this birdhouse it is my favorite 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 style birdhouse it is so goddamn cute. I'm so sorry, but this is so freaking cute. It's a lot cuter in person. I will give you that. It's so cute. Oh my god, I can't even say how cute it is. It's just so freaking precious. She had posted, she's like, can an acorn chirp give me any of my unicorns? And I saw that any one of the teardrop um, birdhouses she wanted, I was like, I'm just going to trade my chirp birdhouse for this one because I love this and the prices are still really really expensive off, off of mercari for this style so i had to trade all right guys and that is everything that i got this week with you know done hunting trading buying from my facebook group so i really hope you enjoyed it i'm just curious to see what everyone's per, like preferred taste is or what kind of items you like the most so i'm just just curious which one of the items that I picked up you like the most comment below so again thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe like this video if you did like it, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. <laughs>